Lesson 89, solving problems with two unknowns by graphing. So a system of equations is two or more equations with common variables. It's called a system. Two or more equations with common variables. So here's an example. And we're going to solve it by graphing. So there are two numbers. Their sum is 10. And one of the numbers is six more than the other. So we're going to call one number x and one number y. So we have x plus y equals 10. And if you take y and take away x, you're going to get 6. So one is 6 more than the other. I just chose that y was the bigger number. So we're going to graph both of those. So x plus y equals 10. We can do a table of values. If we have 0 on x, y is 10. If x is 1, y is 9. If x is 2, y is 8. If x is negative 1, y is 11. And then if we have y minus x equals 6, we're going to take x and y. If x is 0, y is going to be 6. If x is 1, y has to be 7. 2, y has to be 8. If x is negative 1, y has to be 5. So we're going to graph both of them on the same set of axes. So we're going to go up to 11. And we're going to go left to negative 5. We're going to go right to 5. And we're going to graph these. So let's see, 0, 10, this is the first one, 1, 9, 2, 8, and negative 1, 11. So this is a line, so we're going to make it straight through those points and put arrows on it. The second line is 0, 6, 1, 7, 2, 8, and negative 1, 5. The solution is the point where they intersect. So this line was y minus x equals 6, and this y was x plus y equals 10. So the lines crossed at this point to 8. So the solution is where both lines cross. Is where both lines cross. So when x equals 2 and y equals 8, it makes both equations true. The first one was if we add them, we get 10. And the second one's if we subtract x from y, we get 6. So we plug it in, make sure it works, and then we know that's the real solution. That's the end of the lesson.